This is a data structures question based upon binary search tree. We have been given a BST with 1000 distinct elements and it is also a complete binary tree, which means we'll start filling from the left. Every node will have zero or two children. That's how this tree is stored using the array representation of binary heap trees. Assuming that the array indices start with zero, the third largest element of the tree is stored at what index? That's what we need to find out. So for this, let us first consider the smaller version of the tree. It will be something like this. Let us say, yeah, this much. And it is stored in the array representation of binary heap trees. So the indices would be made this way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and so on. We are considering one based indexing for the time being. And this is a complete BST. The last level is incompletely filled. We use the level wise traversal of this tree for putting the indices. Now, if this is also a BST, then where will the largest element be stored in this tree? The index seven will be having the maximum value because that is how the rightmost traversal that is the last node in that side. So it will be having the maximum value that is our first maximum element. And where would the second maximum be located? That will be in this its parent node, which is index three, because seven is maximum than three and all others will be lesser than three. So this is our second maximum. And what about the third maximum? That would be the left child of three. Because three is the second maximum. Six is the only node, which is lesser than three in this case and all others are smaller so this is our third maximum and if the last level were full then definitely whichever was the last node in this tree would have been the oh, first maximum what about second and third maximum let us consider another tree in this particular tree this is our first maximum this would be the second maximum and its left child would be the third maximum. The same thing is taking place over here just because the last level is incomplete filled. We are looking at the upper levels. Now, when we transform this into our example, we are having 1000 distinct elements. So the tree would be something like this. Last level will also be incompletely filled in this tree just because uh, the number of nodes is 1000 for a complete binary tree. The number of nodes has to be a power of two minus one, which is not there in this case. So last level is incomplete. And how many levels will be there in this tree? Let us consider this to be level zero, level one, level two. And as we can see in the level zero index is two power zero starting index. Here it is two power one. Here it is in this is level three, so two power three, eight. So in our tree, level zero, level one, we are having it up to 1000. So in level eight, the index will start from two power eight, that is 256. In level nine, the index will start from 512 and go up to 1000. That will be the last level. So in this particular tree, where will be the first maximum be located that would be in this particular position this is our first maximum the rightmost node and as we just saw in our example second maximum would be its parent and third maximum would be its left sibling so we got the first second and third maximum now we want to find out their indices now this first node is the rightmost node in eighth level which is starting from the index 256 and just next level is starting with index 512. Hence the index of first maximum node will be 511 and its left child will be having the index 510. So it's left sibling. But because the indexes are starting from zero as per given in the question, we'll be reporting 509 in place of 510. Hence the correct answer would be 509.